what I love about this upcoming 2020 is that it's not just a new year. It's a new decade. It is completely new. And even with this 2020, it's like 2020 vision, seeing clearly, no blurry vision. And when you're going somewhere, you got to see where you're going. Amen. So funny, funny story that happened to me. Um, well, it wasn't that funny to me. I was really sad at the moment. <laughs> but now it's funny when I look back at it. Um, so my husband and I, we used to live in Atlanta with our family. And about a year ago, we moved down to Florida. So I had to switch licenses. So we go to the license place, get our licenses. And my husband's sitting next to me. And he passed his test. They're like, okay, you're good to go. And then I'm sitting there. And um, they're like, okay, now look in here and, you know, tell me what the words are. Tell me what you see. And I'm trying to repeat the letters that I see and everything. And they're like, no, no. And I'm like, what? Like, what? <laughs> and like that last line, I couldn't even see it. And she's like, honey, we ain't giving you your license until you go see the eye doctor. I think you may need some glasses. And I was just so sad because I always told everyone, I would tell my husband all the time, I'm like, I got good eyes. Like, I can see. Like, I was really confident in my eyesight. Like, I thought my eyesight was so great. Um, so I literally sat there at the driver's license place like, can I try again? Can I try again? And I kept failing. And I was really sad that day. Like, I was like, oh my gosh, my eyes aren't as great. Lord, I need healing. Um, so we went and I got my glasses for the first time. And I put them on and I was like, oh my, has anyone ever experienced that? Like, oh my gosh, this is what the world looks like. It's so clear. So for a good three days, I just kept doing this. Like, to really see, it was like the world was in 3D. Um, but it's like, she refused to give me my license until I was able to see clearly. And in the same way, it's like, you can't really go where you need to go until you have that clear vision, until you have that clear sight. And for 2020, God has a promised land ahead of us. God has something specifically in store for each and every one of us. But with that 2020 promise comes that 2020 vision. So whatever tinted perspective that we have, whatever blurry perspective that we have from whatever it may be, from our past or from how we see relationships, whatever it is, I just want to ask God, like, God, just clear our vision today. If any of us are not seeing clearly, if there's anything within us that is unlike you, God, just remove those things in the name of Jesus, Lord God. Give us a deeper, deeper level of revelation and understanding in the name of Jesus, Lord God. If any of us does not know you, Lord God, I pray, Lord God, that you would remove the binders, Lord God, that you would remove the veil in the name of Jesus, Lord God. Remove every veil. I thank you, Lord God, that you are bringing us out of darkness into your glorious light. In Jesus' name, God. Hallelujah. Mm -hmm.